I know what you're thinking. Brad Pitt stunt double, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Just after the accident. <laughs> I know what you're thinking, fella. You're thinking, fuck me, Steve Rockley's had a makeover. <laughs> No, it's just been on this morning. <laughs> In case you have something you're wondering, my, my left hand does a lot of crazy, sh crazy shit. And my family de kindly decided to nickname him Wilf. I like to think it stands for wife I'd like to find attractive. No, it's really wife I'd like to fuck. <laughs> I, I say I can't control it, but it does know the difference between the fitty and the minga. So, if I do grope you warmly by the arse, please take it to compliments. <laughs> Stand up comedy. Well, that's a good fucking start, isn't it? <laughs> Been in the business five minutes and I've already invented my own genre of comedy. This <laughs> is the trouble with booking racks on Facebook. Profile pictures can be very deceptive. <laughs> I'm really a lonely housewife looking for love. <laughs> People ask me, why did you want to be a comedian? Well, I wanted to be a footballer originally. <laughs> Can't think why I didn't succeed. <laughs> Maybe it's because I've got two left feet. <laughs> I used to love it when I was a kid though, especially at kids' parties. <laughs> When they played musical chairs, I always won. <laughs> it's, it, it's a bit of an advantage being this low down, especially when it comes to the ladies, because they have to bend over and give you a cuddle. <laughs> they're, just think, they're just thinking, let's give the poor disabled boy a cuddle. I'm thinking, there's one for the wank bank. <laughs> Old ladies come up to me in the street and you know what they're like, patronising fuckers. <laughs> they come up to me and they say, Ah, oh, how are you? I just go, I'm fine, thanks, I'm off to the off license. But how are you? <laughs> um, I, saw, I saw an advert uh, recently for, for a drama school. I misread it, I thought they said spaz hands instead of jazz hands. <laughs> Um, a, line, a line I like to use with the ladies is um, my third leg is the only one that works. <laughs> I went to the job centre the other day. Fuck me, that's a depressing place. I, I just had to go down there to prove that a miracle hadn't occurred and I was still disabled. <laughs> and the woman behind the counter had the audacity to ask me, are you disabled? <laughs> what do you think this is, love? A fucking fashion accessory? <laughs> well, being disabled is one of the few growth industries left in this country. <laughs> you get paid for sitting on your ass and doing nothing. Uh, you know when you're, uh, you're 15, 16 years old, I know it's a bit long way away from some of you, but... Um, you know when you're 15, like 16 years old and you were just waiting for things to happen because you couldn't drink, you couldn't smoke, you couldn't do anything, couldn't have sex. Well, I'm 21 now and I'm still waiting. <laughs> um, that's, actually, that's actually a lie. I, I have recently lost my Bevo's. I've lost it to a disabled girl. Well, I always wanted it to be special. <laughs> <laughs> about having a girlfriend in a wheelchair, she can't run away. <laughs> One thing that did scare me, scare me though, she was a bit older than me, she was 27, she was thinking about marriage and babies, I was thinking, fuck me, not babies, I can't even wipe my own ass, let alone anyone else. <laughs> so ladies, if you do fancy a bit tonight, it'll have to be your place. Unless you've got a top floor flat, then we're both fucked. <laughs> <laughs> um, go on Facebook. Anybody got Facebook? Yeah. Hey! I just use it for the wrong reasons, really. Oh, uh, you know, you know when you come across someone's profile, you think, oh, she's nice. I'll have a wank over that one later. <laughs> 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 
type thing is when you meet her in the street the next day and you know you just fucked up over her. <laughs> yeah, that's me. I, I hope you enjoyed it. That's been me. See ya. Thank you.